WBCSD News. In case you missed it, here's a look at what's been happening in the Bakersfield City School District, where children come first. Our next finalist is Nicole Negron. Congratulations to Nicole Negron, a seventh grade English teacher at Sierra Middle School for being named a Kern County Teacher of the Year. Negron was nominated for her dedication to the whole child and her efforts to help her students academically and beyond. She says she is deeply honored to be able to represent BCSD and Kern County as a Teacher of the Year and thanks her principal, Mrs. Julie Short, and her colleagues at Sierra and throughout BCSD for cheering her on and encouraging her to apply. I thank you all for just giving me the support to be able to take that leap and just having my back. Um, it's a great honor to be able to represent you and to move on to possibly represent you at the state and see what comes next. Thank you for everything and thank you for this opportunity. I am glad to be part of the BCSD family. Our phenomenal teachers deserve more than a week of appreciation for all that they do. Just take it from Katie Johnson, an 8th grade student at Chipman Junior High. Um, if I had to describe the Chipman staff in one word, it would definitely be supportive. They're super supportive and just never negative and always giving out a positive vibe at the school. And I would like to thank you Chipman Chargers teachers uh, for helping me get prepared for high school and always believe in, in me. Thank you. To our teachers, we know this is a challenging time, but you continue to shine. We cannot thank you enough for the difference you make in the lives of our students. My students deserve to have the best education, even if it's virtual. We have to give a shout out to Katisha Crony, a social emotional transition program teacher at Frank West. Understanding her students' needs, Mrs. Crony created a private YouTube channel to continue to connect with her students and their families. They know that this is a tough time, but they really, really, really appreciate that myself and other BCSD staff are really reaching out to them and staying in communication with them, still concerned about their child's well-being and their education every day of the week. The classroom may have changed, but the method is still the same. Mrs. Crony, thank you for your devotion to your students. I have a passion for teaching, and my ultimate goal is to make sure that every child receives the best education they can to become the most well-rounded individual because they are future leaders and we need to treat each student as a potential super phenomenal leader and that is my passion and that's why when I teach I give everything that I have from my heart. Another shout out to Miss Michelle Freintovich, a library technician at Harris Elementary. She held a virtual literacy night as a way to reconnect with her hawks. Students and their parents logged on for a read-along and a bit of fun with Miss Michelle. The Harris face liaison, Laura Prado, also joined in to read stories in Spanish. Miss Michelle said, you have no idea how good it felt to read to my students again. I definitely missed my hawks. Great job, Miss Michelle. We end this edition of BCSD News with a fun tribute to students at McKinley Elementary. To our Mustangs and to all of our students at BCSD, we miss you and we can't wait to see you again. Kimmy Mustangs, I miss seeing your happy, smiling faces. Looking forward to the time when we can gather in the garden again. So read a little bit every day, hug your family, stay safe, and remember that we're all in this together. Hello, McKinney Mustangs, Miss Gonzalez here. I hope that you guys are staying safe and healthy during quarantine. I hope that you're keeping busy, spending time with your family, and making smart choices. I can't wait to see all of you guys next year. Love you. Mustangs, this is Miss Castillo, and I just want to say how much 
I miss everybody and that we are all on this together. I'm sure many of you have talked to your teachers on Class Dojo or Google Classroom. Um, or they've given you a phone call. It's just to let you know that we're in this together. We miss you and can't wait to see you soon. Hi, boys and girls. It's Miss Aragine. I want to say I miss you guys, and we will be together again soon. Hello, everybody. Hello to my mini McKinley Mustang. I just want you to know that I miss you. I miss you back. And I'm looking forward to that time when we can see each other again. Good morning, McKinley Mustang. This is Miss Lightfoot. I just wanted to say that I really miss you guys and I hope you're all staying safe and healthy and you're having fun and enjoying time with your family. I really miss you and can't wait to see you. Um, when we get back to school, stay safe and wash your hands. Hello, Mustangs. Bye. Just wanted to send my love. I can't wait to see you guys. We miss you so much. I hope you guys are doing well. Take care. We miss you. We think about you every day. And we can't wait to get back to school so we can all see each other again soon. Hi, McKinley. Just want to say how much we miss you. And we'll see you when school starts again. Hey, all my Mustangs, kids. This is Miss M. Just wanted to let you guys know that I love you and I miss you so much. And be strong. I hope everything is okay. All this will end soon. We're all in this together. Much love to all my Mustang staff and children. Mighty Mustangs, we miss you. Mighty Mustangs, we miss you. Once a Mustang, always a Mustang. See you soon, boys and girls. <laughs>